Teresa Lackey knew that she wanted to improve the 32 acres of mostly overgrown woods around her home near Ashland, Missouri, but she credits the conservation plan that she developed with assistance from the USDA's Natural Resources Conservation Service for helping her turn her goals into reality. I mean, we had this general idea of like, yeah, we want to see more deer in Turkey. We'd like to get the quail back here. We had quail and grass when we first moved out here 20, 22 years ago. There was some quail and grass and we'd like to create where they would come back. Um, so having having some direction with that plan helped clarify, you know, a process to, to move in that direction. Conservation plans are voluntary and free. They simply put on paper what landowners wish to do with their land. Um, and we just kind of brainstormed what and what we wanted and with that and then they helped helped us kind of guide us through what would be would fit into the programs that you had that would match what we wanted to accomplish. Conservation plans are designed to be flexible, and they often change depending on land changes, resource changes, and as new conservation programs are developed. It's a plan on paper. However, when they implement the plan, that's actually what's done on the land. So we, we put it on paper for the landowners to refer to. They can look at those practices. That gives them an idea of how to stay on schedule. So once we have it on paper, then we work with them to, to provide technical assistance and technical advice to actually implement the conservation plan in the field. And that's what we're out here doing today is we're looking at her conservation plan to implement the practices that she's done. The work completed on Lackey's property through both NRCS technical and financial assistance will ultimately lead to the land returning to its natural pre-settlement condition. Instead of cedar trees, the area will feature open areas, wildflowers, and other native plants. Wildlife naturally suited to those areas should return. The, the planning process for us helped us um, kind of get, well, it helped us get a plan for how to, to work toward that. It also helped give us some backup resources to make some things happen faster in a more uh, consolidated way than we could do by ourselves. Visit www.mo dot nrcs dot usda dot gov to learn more or to locate the nrcs office near you